Hi guys, PD here. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to another new video. Today we're checking out a game called Let's Create Pottery in VR. So let's dive in. A big thank you to Oculus and the developers for this review key. Uh, oh, wow, it's popper. Okay, pull it in there. Okay, here we are in the game. I Dream presents Let's Create Pottery VR. Start. Okay, here we are. We're in a really cool little room. I do like that fire there. Nice little room here, look. And we're in the mountains somewhere. Okay, what's this? Inbox. Hello, the Infinite Dreams team would like to thank you for buying Let's Create Pottery. We hope this application will release your creative spirit and bring a lot of unique and relaxing fun to you and your family. Good luck. Okay, message from the developer. Let's create then. Okay, we've got some really cool pottery music. Whatever pottery music sounds like. Okay, I've got one hand here. Where's my other hand? I've got like a menu system on my left hand. Okay, the game's telling me to shrink the pottery and to hold in the button. Okay. Now we're going to make it thinner. Oh, there we go. So you hold down the grip buttons to Manipulate the uh, pottery a lot. Okay, now it's telling me to put it into the kiln. Okay. Okay, job done. We made our first pot. Okay, now it's telling me to bash it or something. Auction house. Oh, there's an auction house, so you can sell it if you want to. Uh, let me go back to editing. I'm not ready to sell it. I'm not ready to sell it. Can I withdraw from the auction? Okay, somebody brought it. Oh, we have confetti falling. Okay, I can hear people talking, but there's no one in here. Okay, tutorial over. So we're going to make a masterpiece. Hello dear, I heard you found yourself a new hobby. And now you're trying to make pottery, so I'm pretty sure you could use some advice from your old aunt, Chloe. Here, try to shape a vase that looks exactly like the one in the picture I sent you and bake it. Finally, don't forget that pottery requires both skill and patience. When you're done, put the vase into the box and wait for my next email. Have fun, Aunt Chloe. Okay, so we need to make this vase here look. Okay, let's grab the clay. Okay, so I've got an outline here on what to do. I don't know what these blocks are here. These, um, is that to add more clay or something? Okay, so this is going to be fun. So we need to, okay, we need to stretch it out. If the developers are watching, it'd be really nice to be able to use both hands to manipulate the clay guys. After all, this is a pottery simulation. I had similar issues with a, a game I played recently called Origami and it was, the, it was the art of folding paper but instead of folding the paper with your hands you clicked, you just click and point so to make a fold you clicked and point it did not make sense in VR I've got some hands in VR why can't I use these hands to actually physically 
manipulate the object. So I have to admit this is a lot better than the origami experience. But it would be really nice to use both hands. Okay, so we need to draw this bit out. Try and do a bulge. How's that? And now we need to try and smooth this bit. I'm getting points based on my skill as well. Okay, that needs to be a bit thinner. A bit thinner there. Okay, this is not as easy as it looks. This is pretty difficult. So now we can try and round this bit. How's that? That's not too bad, is it? Do I need to get perfect stars? That'll do. We're close, aren't we? I have to admit, though, this is uh, quite relaxing. Okay, that was too much. Okay, we just need to um, sort out this bit here. Look. Try and make it a bit more rounded. I'm trying to make it as smooth as I can. Okay, that'll do. That's not too bad, guys. Do I need to be perfect? Can I uh, sell this now? Okay, let's bake it. And it looks like you can colour them as well. Okay, put that in there. I missed the uh, colouring tutorial, I think. I clicked on the wrong button. Okay, so now we can decorate it. And I missed that on the decoration. Okay, that's telling me to put it into the box. Send the order. Okay, next order, please. Nice work. Don't worry that your vase was not perfect. Rome was not built in a day. Now let's move on to something more ambitious. Try to create a nice vase like the red one in the attached picture. You can buy the red paint in the shop. Just remember that painting is all about layers. The more paint you add, the more vivid the colours will be. I have enclosed 10 coins for you. Oh, and one more thing. You need to bait your item before you can paint it, obviously. Good luck, Aunt Chloe. Okay, so... What is that? Shop. Okay, we need to buy red paint. Okay. And let's create a, a new vase. I have to admit, guys, this is a lot more entertaining and a lot more relaxing than the uh, origami one I tried. Despite not having two hands, um, I can't complain. This is pretty, pretty decent. Okay, so we're... We've got the height. Okay, let's book out the top bit. Okay, where's that classic ghost music when you need it? How are we doing? That's not too bad, is it? How's that? Not too bad. Can I smooth it out a little bit? Very gently smooth it out. I could do with like a, a smoothing spatula so that I can like smooth it down. I don't feel like the hands are precise enough to smooth the pottery. I think you need uh, some sort of device which might come later on in the game, guys. I might be I might be jumping ahead of the game here. Okay, I can't quite get five stars on the on the design part. Okay, let me try smoothing that bit there. That made it worse. Okay, that will do. Let's fire it up. Bake it. Put it in the kiln. 
Oh, it's night time now, look. The stars are out. Any shooting stars? I love seeing shooting stars in VR games, guys. I can't see no shooting stars. Shooting stars in VR games make a really nice touch. Okay. So now we're going to paint it. And we're going to paint it red. Okay, here we go. Oh, cool. That's pretty cool. So it's like painting it in layers. Look at that. Now that is satisfying. That really is satisfying, guys. And we're trying to get an even... We're trying to get an even colour. I want a bit more red. I want a really nice deep red. There we go. Look, five stars. Almost perfect vase there. Okay, let's put it in the box. Okay, put this in the box. That was really satisfying, I have to admit. Can you imagine this game on the Quest with the hand tracking? That would be amazing. Developers, Oculus Quest, hand tracking, this game, 100% amazing. Okay, what are the stars for? Okay, we have a, another email. Well done, I can see real progress. Now try to make a beautiful vase. There's a picture included to help you. Oh, and don't forget to buy the correct basic brushes from the pottery store, as this will ensure that you obtain exactly the same pattern on your own vase. I already enclosed 60 coins with this letter. If you succeed, I will show you your work to some of my friends. Who knows, maybe they will contact you. Okay, thank you, Aunt Chloe. Thank you for all these coins. Uh, I need a. Uh, I need to buy that pattern, don't I? Okay, which was the pattern? Where's that picture? It's there, lot. Okay, so we need to. So we need to design this vase. We need these. I think we need the stripes. I'm buying all these dark bands here, look. What's that? Basic. Okay, let's create this beautiful vase. I'm going to try and get five stars across the board, okay. Okay, there's no guide this time. Look on the... on the height. And there's no outline this time. Oh, there we go. That's the height. Okay, let's go for a thin neck. Okay, let's try and get... Let's try and get five stars on this one. Okay, all nearly five stars. Okay, so what's uh, wrong here? Where do we need to... Do I need to make this thinner? Five stars. That'll do me. Okay, let's cook it. Five stars. I do like the progress in this game, I must admit. The origami one I was talking about is really basic and simple. This has got a lot more depth to it. Okay, so we're looking for patterns. Okay, we need to put a black stripe on here. Around the top. And the smaller one. the thin one that's not bad is it okay this one we need one two three four one two oh how do I delete that 
grays, okay? Okay, now we need the thin ones here. One, two, three, four. And finally, one, two. Oh, that's a thick one. Okay, so erase that. Try again, let's go for the thin ones. Five stars across the board. How cool is that? Okay, I'm quite digging this now. Let's try one more vase. That looks pretty cool. Okay, this is turning out to be a lot better than I was expecting, to be honest. Hello, got your email from my friend Chloe. I was in Greece last summer and when I visited the National Museum of Athens, I found a gorgeous antique amphoria. Obviously, this amazing piece of art was not for sale, so I would like you to create a copy of it based on the picture I took. Okay. I know, I know, an anthoria is not the practical nowadays, so I decided that you should make a vase instead. Just keep the general shape of the anthoria, but give it a flat bottom so I could use it as a vase. I'm sure it would make a wonderful addition to my flowers. I will pay you 50 coins for it, Rebecca York. Okay, let's try this one. And then we'll end the video. Okay, this is a shorter one. Okay, so it's quite thin at the bottom, quite thick at the top. How's that? Oh, okay, too much clay there. Trying to get this um, shaped. Like I said, it's not easy. I totally messed it up. <laughs> Look at that. Now that's my version of this, so I'm going to do my version. Stuff you. Okay, my version looks better. Just be careful not to um, crack the neck. What is that? Is that a different type of clay? Okay, let's bake it. This will do. This is the Paradise Decay version. In 200 years it will be a classic. Are we going to paint it? No, we're not going to paint it. Okay, job done. Look at that. Perfect. I could have smoothed off the bottom a little bit, but uh, classic antique there. Auction house. Let's sell it. I'm going to sell it, guys. It's my uh, my creation, my work of art. Let's see how much we can get for my uh, for my art. I hear six. Nine. Okay, she was going to pay me. She was going to pay me fifty coins. I got nine coins. So I guess we'd have to make another one for my, for the lady, in question. Okay, guys, I'll leave it there. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe. Be sure to my little bell, and I'll see you in the next one. Stay safe. How thin can I make this? I made a pipe! Clay pipe! It's a masterpiece! It's a fountain! 
kan jeg ellers med Camini Fountain.